there's probably three times in my life where I had a little conversation with God. All I said was that I wanted to sing and that I wanted him to use me. I didn't know what that looked like and I didn't even know if it would happen. Definitely not thinking that I'd move to Sydney because I didn't like Sydney. <laughs> it smelled. <laughs> I kind of was in a place where I had $200 left in the bank and it was for the next week's rent and that's all I had. Everyone else said I was crazy because they're like, especially my mom, she's like, my dad, they're like, you have $200, that's all you have. So I moved down, visited the city campus and I was like, just amazed by the worship. And I said to God, I was like, oh, like I love the heart of worship here and like, you know what they're doing. And I was like, if I could just be part of it, I'd love to. And then, how many years later you look and you're like, I'm working at the city campus. It's just, I don't know, just little things where I'm like, God loves me. And he puts all these things in place. <laughs> I just love Jesus and I love his presence and I love the fact that we get to sing and, and just worship him. I actually used to look after the vocal team in the city campus up until a few months ago when my job role changed and I started touring just as a full-time job. I'd actually done like a lot of secular gigs and I learned a lot of stuff, but it was nothing compared to singing in church. It's so much different with the joy factor. Some people don't actually know how to worship God or they haven't encountered him before, so sometimes all they need is like someone just to lift their hands for them to go, Oh, like maybe I should do that and like actually lifting your hands is like a sign of surrender and it's so I love doing it <laughs> all the time you see me <laughs> I grew up in a Christian home I accepted him into my heart actually when I was five but it was when I was like 16 17 when I kind of made the decision to like go to church for myself because I wanted to go from then, I've never had to live thinking there's got to be more than this. Like, I honestly don't know how people do life without Jesus. There's purpose, there's calling. Like, I know who I am in Him, despite if other people say other things against me. And I know what I'm here to, you know, here to do. I, I guess you could say I'm a worshiper. Like, I love Jesus and I hope that I draw people closer to Him. You know, a song can reach people and it's disarming. And I think that's what I love about worship is music has always been something that connects me to God straight away. And I realized a bit of like, God, who am I to be here? Like, you know, to like lead these people, like, I, I'm just a country girl. <laughs>